Beautiful day. Mm -hmm. Happening today, a big birthday for a local favorite. Dog and Suds in Lafayette is 60 years old, and it's marking the day with a big celebration. Drive-in restaurants used to be incredibly popular decades ago, but they've largely gone away in recent years. So we wanted to take a trip back in time to see how this one has made it so long. Along Sagamore Parkway in Lafayette, a lot of things have come and gone over the years, but here... It's definitely a landmark in Lafayette. This hot dog and root beer stand has withstood the test of time. Everybody gets excited as soon as you hear about Dog and Says opening. 60 years. Six decades, and Dan Washington... Total is 722, thank you, sir. ...has owned this Dog and Suds for the last two. It's been a long time. It's... it's survived a lot of things. And seen a lot of change culturally and physically. We were built in the country back in the 1956 when the store was built. 52 was a two-lane road. Surrounded by cornfields. Drive-in root beer stands are largely a thing of the past, a symbol of the 50s and 60s that has just kind of faded away over the years. So we wanted to know, how has this place been able to stay open for 60 years? We were fortunate enough that this was built on a road that then became a four-lane highway. And the only way to get from Indianapolis to Chicago was on 52. And then the city blew up around us. They found themselves in the center of Lafayette's east side business corridor. When the interstate system came into being, that's where most of the drive-ins went out of business because they were in small towns on highways that dried up when the interstate system was put into place. Dog and Sud's location, he says, has saved this place along with a loyal customer base that hasn't seemed to slow down. Yes, I'd like a cheeseburger and french fries. Now, as they continue to preserve a nostalgic piece of the past, they are also looking forward to the future and Washington's son, who will likely take over when the time is right. My hope is that he'll be able to, to have the number of years in, invested in it that I have and be able to maintain this and, and see it into the future.